Yo, Senor Gonzalez. Como esta? Muy bien. You're everywhere, brother. Yo, I'm I'm here, I'm there, I'm everywhere. You know, trying to make it happen. And from, you're, I'm saying you're everywhere. You're with Coach Carter, Sam Jackson. Next thing, Tom Cruise, War of the World. Yeah, then after that, Roll get, Bounce. But don't you got Get Tito coming too? Get Tito. Shout out to my man, Humberto Gonzalez. You know, hopefully that happens. If it happens, it pops off. We'll try to make that happen. Let's talk a little about Coach Carter. I haven't seen the film. Yeah. But they're saying that you even outperformed Mace Windu. I mean, Sam Jackson. Ah. Now, I don't, I don't think you can outperform Shaft. I even tried to hit Shaft. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, I mean, working alongside uh, Shaft was amazing. Was amazing. Was it? Was amazing. I had a great time. Let's talk, let's talk about War of the Worlds. Talk about your character in War of the Worlds. I can't really speak on it, man, but that's a good try, though. But Steven, Steven that's a good try. Steven, Steven's not watching? Nah, Steven will get me. Trust me. Yeah, Deco- I was he's talking two million, to Who's two billion dollars deep? He could get me. Two, 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 two point five. Two, okay, Stan, I, I can't keep up. So we're in the world, but you're... Uh, but I had, a, I had a cool role in that. I worked alongside Tom. How about, um, little, had, how about little Dakota? I didn't get to work with Dakota, but just working alongside Tom is enough for me and Steven. So, hey, you know, it's all good. I'll get her on the next film. So Latinos are everywhere. You think you're gonna hook up with some of the Latino directors too, like maybe I'm Rob to, Rodriguez? I'm to shout or... out to my man Frank Reyes. He's a up and coming Latino director. He did Empire. You know what I'm saying we're about to do some stuff with him. That's called a setup, you know, which was rewritten by Sidney Lumet. So definitely doing big things. A friend of mine, Kelvin from Latino Review, was yeah. talking to me a little bit about Get Tito. Yeah. How 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 are you sure? Do you think that film's gonna get done? I I, I hope so. For Umberto Gonzalez's sake, he's an up and coming screenwriter and film director, and I want to see more Latinos out there get their projects done, get their work out there. So you know, we definitely trying to make things happen. You know what I'm saying? That's why I'm like supporting the movement because I'm here to start it. You know what I mean? But now, a year, two years, three years down the line, what do you see yourself doing? I see myself being the leading man for the Latino culture, green light in $20 million films, making it happen. You know, um, so being that dude to represent, stepping out, you know what I'm saying? No disrespect to John Leguizamo because that's my hero, but finally getting the, the respect we deserve. Well, and the directors are doing a great job, too, Alfonso, and you got Javier Bardem, you know. Yeah, man, those guys are doing a great job. We just Now we just need to leave roles. We need to start putting seats, you know, people in the seats because of us. So, okay, so tell us, we want to see War of the Worlds, right? Yeah, you want to see that. That's going to be big. You can tell us how intense it was. Though. No, it was intense. It was working. I mean, those guys are doing it big. They're going out there. They're going out there. Are you done? Because they're still filming. Yeah, they're still filming. Done? Done? finished working on my stuff. Yep. Yeah. Okay, you know, I don't want to get you to trouble with Steven there. <laughs> See, I don't know you're trying. Why do Latinos try to get me? Why you try to get me? I'm no, good. We no, good. Where are you, where, when, are you and, Boricua or what? Yeah, Boricua and Dominican. Dominicano, Tigre. Yeah, yeah baby. Uh, I'm oye, from the other island. Oye, está bien. Oye, loco. I'm from the other island. I'm from Cuba. Cuba. That's what's up. That's what's up. It's all, it's all, it's all love. It's all love. Lechon, whatever. Uh-huh. How, was, how was New Year's for you? New Year's was lovely. Spent it with family and friends. I had a great time, man. Good deal. Rick, it's good a pleasure talking to you. Pleasure to meet you. You know, I, I, a couple of times we try to run into each other, but you're always they always cut you short. You yeah. know. But listen, take yeah. care, and we'll see you again soon. Absolutely. War of the Worlds. The world's road bounce. Coach Carter, January 14th. Check it out. When do you think Get Tito's gonna get started? Um, hopefully this year. Hopefully this year. Sometime maybe in the summer. So can you tell you know can you tell us a little bit about that film or what you read in the script? Getito is basic based on um no 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 Getito is based on the story about um uh, this character um who's getting chased by the mob for something they didn't do and so um it's like a it's like a big it's like it's like a lot of drama and action involved so someone says it was they were comparing it to another classic film The Wanderers or something like that um you know it has a lot of elements he put a lot of elements that are very familiar. You know what I'm saying? And it's definitely a script that um, I respected. And, you know, being that a Latino wrote it, I was, like, so thrilled. You know what I mean? So, so it's like Italians versus Latinos in New York. <laughs> well, more like one Latino versus Italians. <laughs> yeah. All right. Take care, brother. Thank you, man. God Appreciate bless. It. Take care.